Hello. Today is the 9th of March 2019 and it is day 23 of GHV Airfield Savers. And despite the looks to the contrary, and there are two models on my desk at the moment, this is not a session on modelling. I'm merely using the two models here to illustrate a historical point. Now the first airfield for Get Ivalari is at Marshland, which is about 15, 10 to 15 minutes out of Downham Market. Now Downham Market itself has an airfield, or had an airfield. Uh, it's called RAF Downham Market, and that's just to the east of Downham Market, uh, at a little village called Bexwell. Unfortunately, it's more or less ploughed up now. It was a World War II airfield, uh, mainly having Stirlings, uh, Lancasters, Mosquitoes and a few Hawsers during the D-Day invasion. Uh, it was a satellite of RF Marham, which is a little further across to the east near Narborough. And beyond that was a Royal Flying Corps airfield called Narborough as well, uh, which is also famous for having uh, uh, a certain person called W.E. Johns there, who is very famous for inventing the, the uh, aviation figure of Biggles. RF down the market had two famous people there, They're both uh, Victoria Cross winners. Uh, Willoughby Basiljet, Ian, Will sorry, Ian Willoughby Basiljet uh, of uh, 635 Squadron, Lancaster Squadron, Canadian, and also Pilot Officer Arthur Lewis Aron of 218 Squadron, who was a Sterling pilot. But we'll go into more details of that in another episode. But we just cast our mind back again now to the Royal Flying Corps because this is what these models uh, show here at the moment. Uh, uh, and there's another down and market connection here. Now, first of all, the actual models themselves. This is a Rodan model of the uh, immediate precursor to the Fokker triplane. This is actually the prototype version under development, the DR1. Uh, and it's attacking a Sopwith Pup, which is again the, uh, an aircraft that came just before the Sopwith Camel, the, the better known Sopwith Camel. Now, as you might have guessed, flying the Fokker triplane, although this particular one is an earlier prototype version and not in his, his later all red aircraft, is Manfred von Richthofen. Now, he was out in France testing his Fokker triplane uh, under the tutelage of Anthony Fokker, who designed the actual aircraft himself. And one particular day, he took it up uh, towards the, the Western Front and he pounced upon a poor little Sopwith pup. Now, a Sopwith pup had actually come up to meet him because the pilot of the Sopwith pup had been told that he was going to to meet a group of Royal Naval Air Service Sopwith triplanes, which are triplanes that look very much like the, uh, uh, the Fokker triplanes, slightly bigger with squared wings and, and a radial engine in the front as well, like that. And as he got close, he suddenly realised it wasn't a Sopwith triplane, it was a Fokker triplane. And Manfred von Richthofen pounced upon him and shot him down. Luckily, he survived, the, the, R, the RFC pilot survived the crash and uh, went to a German prison. Now this film that exists of Manfred von Richthofen and Anthony Fokker talking to the pilot who was shot down by his Sopwith triplane, um, which is interesting in its own right, but it's even more interesting for us here in Downer Market because the actual uh, pilot who was shot down was none other than uh, uh, Lieutenant Algernon Bird of number 46 Squadron, Royal Flying Corps. Now he was a famous Downham Market personage because if you ever come to Downham Market and you come from the uh, Wisbeach direction and go across the railway uh, in, uh, up the hill into Downham Market, you go past on the right hand side just before the railway station, it's a huge mill, it's one of the biggest uh, in the area, it's a flour mill, it's now called Haygate's Flour Mill and if you look over the top of it there is a little eagle on the one of the door entrances. Now. People think that it was called a certain name because of that, but it's not. It's because of the family who originally owned it and were the original millers there. And they were the Bird family. And Algernon Bird was one of the owners of that mill. And the eagle there, 
I think he said a little pun on their own name there because they also he also had it on his house in Downham Market, which is now the Conservative Club. So Algernon Bird was the owner of one of the biggest employers in Downham Market that ever was, and probably still is, Haygate, which is now Haygate's Mill rather than Bird's Mill, still locally known as Bird's Mill. Um, but luckily, when he was shot down and interviewed by Anthony Fokker and uh, von Richthofen, uh, he survived it. He went to a prison of war camp. He survived the war. Von Richthofen was shot down and killed about eight months later. So he was more lucky than that. And he lived on to uh, an age of gone 60 in Down the Market before dying in the 1950s. Um, and people still remember uh, Algernon and Bird going that far back. So there's a little connection there between Down the Market and aviation and the models I've made here of showing Algernon and Bird being shot down by Manfred von Richthofen, his 61st victim, one of his first in a triplane. So that's today's little potted history lesson. I'm going to go into more detail of the history of Down and Market and the airfields that we come across as we help build and develop uh, uh, Getai Volare. But that's a, a little potted history for now. Thank you.